Welcome on my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'll show how to make vertically split screen with two different colors and Google material icons displayed. Create index.html file and open in VS Code Editor. Four material icons will be used to this link. For left side of screen will be added word left. For right side of screen will be added word right. Create DVS class content. Another DVS class icons. I with class material icons. And for the project, I'll be using this icon called apps. Add word app. Copy it and do one change. Instead of app, will be used computer icon. So change word app to computer. Open index.html file in Google Chrome or you can start live server. Reload the page. And this is how it looks now, two icons displayed correctly. As it is a small project, I will add a CSS part into HTML file. If you want, you can create a separate CSS file and link it. For body, margin and padding, zero. For split, width 50%, height 100%, top zero, and position fixed. For left side of the screen, left zero, Background color will be bright blue. Copy it, left change to also right, and background color will be bright yellow. Reload the page, screen split it in half. For content, width 300 pixels, height 200. In order to make this uh, box visible, I will add outline that I will remove in the end of the project, which will be 3 pixels solid white. Reload the page. Here is displayed the box with 300 pixel width and 200 pixel height. Next task is to center this box and center the content inside the box. Top 50%, left 50%, transform, translate, minus 50%, comma, minus 50%. Position absolute, display flex, justify content center, Align items center, align content center, reload the page. Divs are centered. For material icons, font size 96 pixels. For material icons, hover, transform, scale 1.1, color bright red. Previously, I've added outline, so it is time to comment it, save it, reload the page, and this is the final result. Thank you for watching my tutorial. Please consider subscribing. Press like button. If you have any comments, you can write it in the comment section and I will reply on it.